Do people actually get satisfaction from just helping others? It's the only time I feel whole. Just check out your responses. Most people have replied in good faith to help you understand. They have nothing to gain on it for themselves and it costs them time to do it. Still worth it. I'd rather help others than do things I need to do. Like at work, I'd rather help people overwhelm than do my own stuff. If it makes others enjoy their days more, I'm all in. Makes me feel great. I guess in that sense, I do it for selfish reasons. I get contentment out of it. Yes definitely. I'm pretty depressed so I lack satisfaction for a lot of things, but I'll cook a hot meal for my boyfriend when I won't do it for myself because it makes me feel better. Yeah, man. Plenty of people feel good helping others just because they know it will make life better for that person. Yes indeed. I have a pretty dark depression but I deliver meals on wheels once a week. When I ponder falling deeper into my personal abyss, the elderly folks who rely on me always lift my spirits. Lived in Los Angeles County. Had a pickup and carried around a two and a half ton jack in it. If I saw anyone pulled over on the side of the freeway with a flat it'd pull over, ask me if they had a spare. If they did I changed their tire for them quick and easy. And never asked for a dime. I think I did stuff like that cause if I were in the same situation I'd be nice if someone did the same for me rather than hail change your tire for $60. You know? Someone in a tough spot in PPL trying to jack their wallet. Plus, sometimes for a PPL with AAA they might have to wait over an hour or so before one of their trucks can arrive. I know how much I hate being stranded and waiting on someone else. So I was just trying to get them back on their way. I think so. I help people I don't know and will never see again, and it always makes me feel good. Dostoevsky said a drop of kindness could permeate an ocean, and I firmly believe that. It's nice to add positivity to the world. I actually get more satisfaction when the person doesn't know it was you or when they don't have the opportunity to thank me, which can be awkward. I do get a lot of satisfaction from doing something nice anonymously. Absolutely. Yup. I have a strong self-morality around being kind and making the world better for others. Altruism comes naturally to a lot of people and it can be one reason they help others. To put it plainly, you strive to be the change you want to see in the world, and sometimes that means treating others the way you'd like to be treated, with kindness. Other times, it is enjoyable. Seeing others happy and relating to them makes people happy. They know a gift or a kind gesture will make someone else happy and that brings them joy. So there's a bit of Jewish philosophy I think you might find helpful. In Judaism, there are eight levels of charity. And all of them are good works. They vary based on if you're helping the root problem or not. If your recipient would feel indebted to you, if the recipient had to beg or you were on top of that. And if the method discourages future acts of charity but all of them are mitzvahs or good acts. The key here, is that, no matter why, or how much, or in what form you helped out, you helped, and that's what makes the difference in someone's life. So, you shouldn't worry about why you're helping. The important part is that you're helping. Absolutely. Personally I am wired to really enjoy helping. I am not alone in this. Humans have a variety of systems of empathy which allow us to identify with others. To hurt when others are hurting and to feel joy at others' joy. These systems are not equally strong in everyone. And they are definitely neural pathways that can be reinforced or destroyed in either through deliberate effort, through indoctrination, and through trauma. But the statement, humans are selfish creatures, is inaccurate. We are better described as social creatures with a bias towards self-preservation when possible. Yup I do it all the time. Someone's car battery was dead and I gave him a jump today. I don't know the person, and will never see him again, and don't expect to gain anything out of it. It's a compulsion. 
It makes my wife uncomfortable. But I'm the dad that pulls up beside you. Makes the window down motion. And tells you that you have a tire going flat. I'll take on projects that help friends in a heartbeat. I make stuff for free. I'm awful at yard selling. If you give me a sob story, I'll most likely just give it to you. Also I have a thing for getting stuff to the right people. I fully blame my dad. He's the same way. Wife is mostly used to it by now but I still embarrass her on occasion. TLDR. I really, really, like to be useful. I'd rather help and be helped with people I don't know. I don't want to deal with burdensome feelings like thanks and indebtedness. I don't know much about reward, but help is necessary in a society for it to function at a basic level. Humans are not fundamentally selfish. You're wrong about that. Some are. They are sociopaths. Everyone else has some degree of empathy that allows them to feel some of each other's suffering and some reward for helping others. I usually help others to show them I care about them, appreciate them not sure if it's considered an ulterior motive. Yup. Genuinely helping someone gives you a high and makes you feel like you have some value in that er. Efforts getting to where er at. Capable of delivering real help. Weren't worthless after all. If you enjoyed this video, please check out our playlists full of similar content. Epicaracast is like doom scrolling for your ears. Please like, share, and subscribe.